Hello, my name is Jupiter Hadley, and I'm doing a lot of versions of Jupiter's all the games this time with the NAR 8, which is basically a j game jam where you make a game that tells a story. We'll be playing each game for about a minute, 10 games for a video, there'll be about two videos. Um, if you like any of the games specifically, there are links in the description. It's going to be a quick look because these tell a story. There's probably way more to them than what can fit in the minute. I'm sorry, it takes two hours to make one of these videos. That's a long time. But, yeah, thank you very much for watching, as always. Um, check out links in the description. There's links to the jam, links to my Twitter, links to my Twitch TV, links to my Patreon, links to my website, just all my stuff. So you can check that out down below. Um, if you want to like this video, that'd be great. It lets me make more of them. If you want to comment, that's even better because I like interacting with people. And let me know what your favorite story is. Anyway, next. First, we're playing the game Timeless. Timeless, a street view game. Press space to continue. Okay. What happened? How on earth did I get here? Oh. Everything has stopped moving. Hey, you there. Why is everything standing still? Hello? Are you flash mob or something? <laughs> Maybe Darren Brown is messing with everyone's mind. This is really cool. Huh. Jeff. Hey, Bill. How are you doing, buddy? So, why is everyone standing still? Is this some modern art nonsense? Hey, stop worrying, Bill. Time is standing still now. Only you are the one moving. Right, and how did this happen? Well, you're the laziest person in the world. You always wait, want another ten minutes before you wake up. Always putting off jobs and making excuses. Now you have all the time in the world to achieve everything you wanted. Hmm. Nah, I'm going home. See ya. I'll just head to the underground station down here to the right. I'll well, say next. But this is pretty cool. Next. Next, we're playing the game of Visit in Time. How do I identify myself? Yeah, I'm female. Okay, okay. I don't really know where I'm going, to be fair. Hmm. There's no answer. The boat's smaller than me. Huh. What do I do? Boy of cool water sits outside the mine to wash your face and hands and take a deep breath. Next. Next, we're playing the game Deliverance. You can drag, like, things. Congratulations, that's how you play the game. Play. Play. Okay. Welcome to the gambling room. Look, just press on with your task. I delete some of these because I feel like. How? Land bandit gambler. New. Went to the gambling room. Look, just press on with your task. No. Why? Congratulations. I like the graphics. Welcome to the gambling. Press on. Can this be on? On. I don't know. This looks cool. Next. Next, we're playing the game. Issy takes the bus. A short interactive fiction about growing up. 
Oops. There we go. Issy woke up with a start from dreaming from a dreamless slumber. The sound of a passing motorcycle ringing in her big white ears. The mouse was actually quite surprised she managed to fall asleep at all. There had been a lot of things on her mind lately. However, the only thing on her mind at the present was how bright it was outside. Too bright. Sunlight poured in through the large glass pane window of her bedroom. It filled very every dusty cranny with a warm glow. Taking a few deep breaths, she sucked the in the smell around her. There was this pile of old books everywhere. Her life companions. There were even a few lying open at the foot of the bed, split right open where she left off last night. She was tempted to sit up and continue them, but found her body to be very he very heavy and tired. Maybe I should try going back to sleep. But just then, Old Red started to ring loudly and rudely interrupting her morning sen serenity. Izzy made a noise, too, a whimpering groan of protest. Groggily, she rolled over and reached out for the phone, wiping at the air, swiping at the air a few times with her paw before managing to grip the familiar headset. Hello, she sang groggily into the receiver. Izzy, where are you? said Old Red's earpiece barked tersely. I'm gonna say next. Next. Next we're playing the game Compute Thought. Um How do I do this? Oh alarm leave. Okay. Desk okay. Probably get my shit. Not booze. Gun, however. I don't know. Maybe you need booze. Inventory. Pistol. Alright. Open message. Report to the complex. We've got reports of domestic violence. Uh, I should get dressed. I'm in my underwear. <coughs> Sorry. Hold on, close. Huh, that looks better. Do I have a cell phone? Shouldn't I have a cell phone? Bed, booze, couch. Uh, that's basically everything. I have a pistol, no cell phone, and I got dressed. I don't know what apartment we're going to, but okay. Alright, this is, looks really nice. The graphics are really nice. But, yeah, next. Next, we're playing Coming Out Simulator 2014, a half-true game with about half-truths. Hey there, player. Welcome to this game, I guess. What would you like to do now? I'm going to play. Let's play this thing. Jumping right into it. Great. No messing around with reading the credits or about this game section or shh. Fine, fine. Let's travel back four years ago to 2000. And ten. That was four years ago? To everything that changed my life. Tell me, dear player, what do you think? How do you think it all ends? Apparently, with you reading Starbucks. Yes. Hey, I'm coding on this laptop, turning my complete com coming of age story into a game that you're playing right now. Now nah, you're probably procrastinating. Look who's talking. Touche, douche. Anyway, if you want to skip the about this game section, you know it's a very personal story. Shush. This game includes dialogue that I, that my parents and my ex boyfriend actually said, as well as all the things we could have, should have, and never would have said. It doesn't matter which is which, not anymore. True games. How can we win the game? Exactly. <laughs> You're playing as me, Sarka2010. Because you skipped the credits, my not yet legal name is Nikki Case. Just so you know. Shush. This game is coming out, or coming out of age, or coming out of terms, and there are no right answers. Hey, I just said that. This is, I love the graphics and I love the style, but I have to say next. Next. Next, we're playing the game Lake Madeline. Coming here used to mean trying to forget, but now I want to remember. I'm getting it in the rocks, bud. No bite. I'm not really sure what to do. Okay, let's. Right over here. There you go. 
What the hell? You're a terrible fisherman. Get a fish? How many times did we come here that summer? I don't know. Next. Next we're playing Chronicles of Maker, which I remember from the Glitch Jam, and it's got this huge long story that you can't skip, so... So, I'm just gonna pause it and then play the game. Yay! Okay, actual game. It's okay. Children of our great maker. Me and my brothers and sisters all live here in the deep space. Long ago, maker sealed the door to the outer world to keep us safe. Down here, we live carefree, each of us exploring the unique spark that maker gave us. Okay. Maker says that our spark is what separates us from the lesser machines, the spark that lives inside our core matrix processing. Maker says that's where our souls live. Move with mouse, hold shift to run, mouse to rotate. Look at that. Okay. This is Doozy. She's the apple of my eye. <laughs> made Doozy extra special so she could help fix us and get back to you. I wish I could do something special for Doozy, but I don't know what to do. This is adorable. Next. Next, we're playing the game in Corpe Sano. Can we talk? Yes, of course. We have some bad news. What's wrong? Is it my boy? How is he? Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm really sorry. He had a heart attack. I'm sorry. Can I see him? Unfortunately not. We're making some tests on him to discover why it happened. Where is he? To move, you can use arrow keys or a gamepad. Alright, so it's not arrow keys. Yeah, it's arrow keys. Awesome. I'm liking the graphics. I don't know how to find my boy, though. Help me get out of this room. I'm not sure how. Jump out the window. I don't know. I don't know what I need to do. Hmm. Next. Next, we're playing Memoria. Plate 1. View label Bound Church Chwet Isle of Wight 1877. An expert compose the final no the fine Norman church to the right of the frame is partially obscured by an unfocused footage. Foliage? Okay. Animals. Fish. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Animals. Giraffe. Graphy fish, fox, cat, this one, this one, this one, animals, I tried, yeah, this one, giraffe, I did, snail, is that an animal, it's a bug really, chicken, no, oh, wait, this is a cat. Chicken was right there. Chicken. Fish, I don't really know. Next. <laughs> 